Hi, I'm Francis, the host of this show, Cooking with Doug. こんにちは。今日はとってもヘルシーで体が温まる山梨の郷土料理、ほうとうを作ります。First, let's make the dashi stock. Remove the head and stomach from the niboshi, dried baby sardines. This will help to remove any bitterness. Measure out 900 ml of water in a pot and add the dried baby sardines and the dashi kombu seaweed. Niboshi to kombu はこのまま30分以上つけておきます。When they have soaked up the water thoroughly, turn on the burner and gradually bring it to a boil on medium low heat. When it begins to boil, reduce the heat to low and remove the foam with a mesh strainer. Simmer the dashi stock for 4 to 5 minutes. Turn off the burner, remove the kombu seaweed. And place it onto a cutting board. Strain the stock into a pot with a mesh strainer, removing the baby sardines. Finally, cut the kombu seaweed into thin strips. The kombu can be used as one of the ingredients. And now, let's cut the ingredients. Quarter the carrot lengthwise and then slice it into quarter moons. Remove the outer skin of the daikon radish with a peeler. Quarter the daikon and slice it into quarter moons. With a paper towel, Remove the excess oil from the abrage, thin deep fried tofu. Cut it in half and slice it into one inch strips. With your hands, separate the shimeji mushrooms and the maitake mushrooms into bite sized pieces. Remove the root end of the komatsuna spinach. And cut it into one and a half inch pieces. You can substitute any leafy vegetables that have a mild flavor. Slice the long green onion into quarter inch slices using diagonal cuts. With a spoon, remove the seeds from the kabocha squash. Remove the stem end and slice it into half inch pieces. The kabocha is hard. So, be careful not to cut yourself. You can also substitute any type of sweet squash. Remove the stem end of the haksai, nappa cabbage, and cut it into one and a half inch pieces. Separate the white firm part and the leafy part. Now, let's make hoto noodles. To the pot of the dashi stock, add the daikon radish and the carrot, the abrage, and the shimeji and maitake mushrooms. Drop in the shredded kombu seaweed and turn on the burner. Bring it to a boil and then remove the foam. Reduce the heat to low. Cover and simmer for 4 to 5 minutes. Now, drop in the hoto noodles. Add the kabocha and the firm white part of the haksai. Submerge the vegetables into the stock with a ladle. Turn the heat to medium low. Cover. And bring it to a boil again. Occasionally loosen up the noodles with the chopsticks to keep them from sticking together. Simmer the hoto noodles for the cooking time stated on the package. 
Now, dropping the long green onion, leafy part of the haksai, and komatsuna spinach. Simmer for about two more minutes. Finally, ladle the dashi stock into a bowl. Dilute the miso with a balloon whisk. And then add it to the pot. Distribute the miso evenly with the ladle. When it begins to boil again, turn off the burner. Place the pot onto a trivet. And now it is ready to serve. Drop in the mushrooms and the aburage when the stock is cold. This will help to make a delicious dashi stock. Cooking fresh hoto noodles will thicken the dashi stock and help to keep the dish warm. This is a nutritious and balanced recipe, so you should try it out on cold winter days. Good luck in the kitchen! <laughs>